Uh, well, our role was to uphold the mana um, as tangata whenua for this prestigious event. Obviously, the British and Irish Lions uh, coming forth, the uh, New Zealand Rugby Union had envisioned uh, Māori warriors to deliver uh, a, a challenge, well, a ceremony as opposed to a challenge, um, to present seven tayaha to the seven provinces that the British and Irish Lions will be playing in. Uh, it's going to be huge. Like, I think you look back at the World Cup and the amount of people have come in from a long time. You, you know, the Barmy Army is, is massive and I'm sure there will be plenty of uh, you know, British coming over for it. So, um, hope, you know, we know how much New Zealand gets in behind these events and so it's going to be a massive event. I think the Lions is actually probably the best, the best of everything really. It's a competitive team and it's a, an incredibly fanatical bunch of supporters and you know, the, the idea that there's going to be 20,000 you know, crazy Brits coming here and enjoying New Zealand's hospitality and enjoying the country. When they put that Lions jersey on, it's something special. You know, there's not too many teams come out here and have that that the name of the Lions with them. But no, they'll be they'll be great. Northern Hemisphere, I guess, those teams that are coming on and, and Sydney playing some some good footy now. Um, I guess you put them together, it's a cream of the crop, isn't it? So um, for the Lions, and and they're going to be dangerous. They'll be certainly excited and up for the challenge, so I'm sure it's going to be a, a big test. Well, they can expect to be looked after. They can expect to come over here. Um, us New Zealanders, we're good at looking after people. But as soon as it gets to the battlefield, it, it's over. You know, we, we, we go to war, we go to battle. Um, they know that about us and they know we, we want them to, to go home and say we were well looked after, but also we were defeated fairly, fair and square. That's what I'm hoping. We'll certainly welcome as many fans as we, as we can. Hopefully they get to enjoy all of New Zealand and, um, you know, it, People love rugby here and I think uh, you know, if that's what the fans have come for then they're certainly going to have a great experience.